LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys. Notice, many times, laptop manufacturers produce keyboards that look the same on the outside, but have different retainer clips underneath the keys. To help you find the correct repair video for your keyboard, we've created a searchable database. Simply go to LaptopKey.com, enter your laptop brand and model number, scroll down to the bottom of the page and click on View Videos. A list of all compatible videos will appear. Select the retainer clip model that matches your keyboard. That's all, you're now ready to repair your laptop keyboard. For this keyboard, we will be showing the removal and reattachment of the J key for standard size keys, Shift for the wide keys, and F12 for the top row small key. To remove your standard size keys, insert a tool under the upper right corner, apply gentle pressure, and the key cap will remove itself. To remove the retention clip, support the bottom of the clip with your finger and insert a tool to the side of the upper right corner Push inward and up, repeat with the left, and the retention clip will be removed. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip, which has two small holes at the top and two thin long holes at the bottom. For the bottom clip, there is a small upward facing notch on the top side. Connect the two halves together, ensuring the plastic support arms of the top clip connect to the holes of the bottom clip. Then, using metal hooks here, 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 and here, we will lay the clip down, bottom first, supporting the bottom until it hooks on. Small press on the corners. Replace the keycap with a press, and it's functional. To remove the wide set keys, insert your tool under the upper right corner. Gentle upward pressure to both sides. Continue down the bottom, and sides, pull out. There will be a small metal support arm that may or may not release, but we'll come back to that in a moment. To remove the retention clips, support the bottom of the clip with your finger, insert your tool to the side of the upper right corner, push inward and up, repeat with the left, push downward, and the clip will be removed. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip, which has a large hole at the bottom. And for the bottom clip, there is a divot at the top end. Simply connect the two halves together, ensuring the plastic support arms of the top clip enter the holes of the bottom clip. Then using metal hooks here, here, and here, we will lay the clip down bottom first slide on, push on the corners. Then to reattach the metal arm to the keycap, there are a set of holes here, here, and here where the arm will fit in on the bottom side of the keycap. So we will take that, insert one end, lay across the other, making sure it is centered. And we get three distinct snaps. There we are. You'll then insert the ends of the metal hook here and here using holes. Insert, lay down flat, press into the clip, and the key is functional. To remove the top row keys, insert your tool under the upper right corner, apply gentle upward pressure, and the key cap will be removed. To remove the retention clip, support the right side of the clip with your finger. Then insert your tool on either side, push inward and upward, and push down, and the clip will be removed. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip, which has two support at the top and a flat edge at the bottom. For the bottom clip, there's a small upward facing notch on the top end. Reconnect the two halves, making sure the support arms from the top clip enter the holes on the bottom clip. Then using metal hooks here, here, and here, we will connect the clip from the right side first, push across, down, 
on either corner. Take the keycap, place on top with a firm press, and we are functional. We'll now show you how to remove a laptop key. Simply pull on the edge of the key in a gentle but firm motion. Lift up and remove the key. It's that simple. If your key is loose and not sticking properly to your keyboard, your retainer clips are likely broken. This issue can be fixed by replacing your retainer clips. Replacement laptop keys and retainer clips can be purchased at LaptopKey.com. LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys.